Can you sell services online? Like coaching and training and some consulting work, advisory aspects. So not an online course where people buy and consume it on their own. It's more of a one-to-one -one or one-to-many type of aspect where you have a person delivering that. You can, if you think of the people who are delivering that, whether it's one person, you, or you and your team, as you have an inventory of hours. So if you have an inventory of hours, uh, you're able to do three hours, team members are able to do two, six, and so on. Those hours are populated in a booking platform. And then when the user discovers you via ads or whatever channels you, you'll be running, they be make the payment and booking. So they need to be able to do both at the same time. Making a payment without the booking makes it uh, includes a lot, a lot of friction. It's as if you're buying something, you don't know if you're gonna get it next day delivery or in six months. And also in the back, you think about the hours that you're providing as inventory. And this way you'd look at uh, what's my capacity today or this week or this month? What's the consumption of my capacity? Am I at 30%, 60%, 80%, 100%? So that, do I need to add more people, less people? Do I need to increase, increase my ads? So that will help you better manage it if you look at it from an inventory perspective. So two components. One, it's very important to have the booking and the payment done together to reduce the friction and increase the likelihood of somebody buying from you. And the second part, manage your business from a service perspective in terms of an inventory of hours and look at the consumption and the capacity there.